welcome back to my channel. I'm Mascara Cakes. This is a video I've been writing down and preparing for for quite a while and it has nothing to do with makeup at all. So if you don't like non-makeup videos, bye, thanks. So if you're not into that or weird shit in general, this, my friend, is not the place for you. Feel free to X out the video here. No harm, no foul. But I'll remember our time fondly. This if you've read the title, is the hottest animated characters, or characters that I think are the hottest. Yeah, I know they're animated and they're not real, but shut the fuck up. <laughs> like, animated characters can still be cute and still just, yeah, whatever. So these are the ones, I feel like if they were real, they would be hot, all right? Just suspend your belief for just a little bit, all right? Thanks. Okay. Like I said, if you don't like this kind of shit, bye. Thank you for starting. But I don't want any dumbass comments, please. But <laughs> I've been thinking about this video and this list and been writing them down and all that kind of shit. Like, for, hon for honestly, quite a long time. So these aren't really in an order until I get to my first one. Because that's been my very favorite since I was in like fifth grade. And yeah, we'll talk more when we get there. So number 10. This one is mostly like 80% about the voice. Because his voice is so deep and so, oh. Goliath from Gargoyles. 1,000 years ago, superstition and the sword ruled. It was a time of darkness. It was a world of fear. Keith David does his voice and it's and he's just a strong, nice, compassionate character. I love Goliath from Gargoyles. He's excellent. And the voice, ooh, perfect. And then number nine. I watched Voltron. When it first came on when I was little. And I loved Voltron. Like I had two characters. that I, Like toys I got from Voltron for Christmas or whatever. One was Pidge. Who in the old series wasn't a girl. But is a girl in the second one. Spoiler. Sorry. Um, but Princess Laura was the second one. Princess Laura is fucking hot. Alright. And the new one too. Like I love her. She's great. She's super nice. She cares for her people who are... Pretty much all dead. Whatever. But I like, she's pretty hot. <laughs> Number eight. Again, this is one from when I was little. And it, that one, this one got a reboot too. Was She-Ra. Like, woo. she was a hottie. She was a little, she feels a lot older when she was in my, when, when I was younger. The new one's kind of, Younger, so that's a little weird. But Shira, my younger days, was a hottie. Number seven. Now, I started this anime, and I haven't finished it, so I don't really know all the ins and outs. But so far, Kakashi is a major hottie. He's really cute. And I, like I said, it was a while ago that I started it, and I haven't picked it back up. So I don't know, this one's going purely on looks, but or purely on looks in an animation. But you get what I'm saying. He looks, yeah, okay, shut up. Alright, number six. Now, one of my favorite newer TV animated shows is The Dragon Prince. I think it's very well, well written. The animation is really good. And some of the, a couple of those characters, well, three of those characters are pretty hot for an animated character. Number six on my list is Corvus, who was a, um, somebody sent out to find, I don't remember, was a, a scout, I think, to find the, the princes and I don't know. But he is, he's pretty hot. I mean, Yeah. Now, number four is, again, something, an anime 
that I've loved long, like a really long time, at least since elementary school, or at least since middle school, if not longer, is Darian from Tuxedo Mask, or from Sailor Moon, who's also a Tuxedo Mask. Like, come on, he comes in, saves Sailor Moon all the time, throws roses, like, oh, that's so romantic. How can you not love that? Like, if I didn't have him on here, I I shouldn't even be making this list. Because I love Sailor Moon, so obviously. Also, he's also Moonlight Knight, so I guess he's all three, but... Either way, he throws roses, and it's super romantic, and super handsome, and he loves Sailor Moon, and it's adorable, he loves his kid. It's, aw, I love Darian from Sailor Moon. <laughs> Alright, number three is from Seven Deadly Sins on Netflix. Dragon Prince is on Netflix too, by the way. But, Seven Deadly Sins is... There's a character called Bon. It looks like Bane, but it's Bon. I okay, which which sin is he? Is he greed? Yeah, I think he's the sin of greed. No. Uh shit, why can't I remember? I don't know. But what the fuck ever, Bon is fucking hot. Yeah. Sorry, it's fucking weird, that's fine. But whatever. I, yeah, Bon. <laughs> and then number two is also from the Dragon Prince. And that one is King Harrow. That fucking cartoon king. <laughs> I sound so stupid even talking about it. But yeah, he's, he's pretty fucking hot for a cartoon I mean, it's not my fault that these people animate these characters so well. Like, come on. Now, my number one hottest animated character. This one, I think, is actually the one that I've had a weird animated attraction to the longest. This one is Gambit. <laughs> From the original 90s X-Men animated series. I, well first of all, I loved that series so fucking much. Like, oh my gosh, that was the best shit ever. Oh, that was the best. But Gambit was just, I don't, man, I think it was his freaking, um, Nolan's accent. How did you do that? With style, Petit. With style. <laughs> Act like tourists, but keep your eyes open. You're on a mission. Relax, Cyclops. All work and no play makes Jacques a dull boy. <laughs> you want to play with Gambit? Here, take a car. Storm, we got trouble Jeez. out here. What's wrong? Wolverine. Felt him. Such pain. Man been a pain since the get-go, Chef. Not funny. Or, I don't know, but he was just, he started off me, it's okay to think animated characters are cute, because Gambit is fucking cute. So, thanks a lot, Gambit. You were the one who originally inspired this weird list and this video. So those are my top 10, in no particular order except Gambit, hottest animated characters. Again, this might be weird for you and that's fine. It's not that weird for me. So let me know below if you agree with any of those, who your own hot animated character is. I know it's weird. I fucking know. But... Let me know down below what yours is. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.